about what's shaking, what's happening. I'm Sydney, your Sunny Health and Fitness Trainer, and today I have a quick 10 minute hip elliptical workout for you guys. So, no extra chitter chatter for me. Let's pop up onto our ellipticals and get going here. We're gonna start with a quick one minute warm up at a resistance of one. So, if your resistance is at six like me, take it down to one. There we go. All right, so nice and easy. We're just gonna warm up here for one minute. Whatever pace you need, we're warming up those muscles, warming up our heart, our lungs, making sure everything is ready to go. All right, we have some intervals today. So we're gonna be doing 30 seconds on to 30 seconds off. That 30 seconds on is going to be an all out sprint. And the 30 seconds off will be a full recovery. So as slow as you need, whatever you need today. All right, I'm going to leave the resistance open-ended. So wherever your fitness level is at and whatever kind of workout you want today, select the appropriate resistance for you. And we will get started. 10 seconds, we're gonna hit our first 30 second interval. Coming up quick. All right, are we ready? In three, two, and one. Let's push that pace. 30 seconds as fast as you can. All right, we're pushing with our legs and our arms. This is a full body workout. I want everything working. Almost there, 10 more seconds. Great job, guys. In three, two, and one. All right, slow down that pace. If you have that resistance nice and high, go ahead and bring it down for our recovery. We're going to hit our next sprint in right around 15 seconds. All right, so coming up quick. We don't have a lot of time today, so I want you guys really on it. All right, let's make the most of this 10 minutes. Ready, next sprint in three, two, and one. Let's do it. Remember, while we're pushing, core is nice and tight. All right, it's engaged throughout your whole workout. That way those arms and legs can push with more power. Stay on it, 10 more seconds to go. Great work in three, two, and one. All right, recovery. Soak it in. Remember, as slow as you need to go on this recovery, if you wanna stop moving completely, that is totally fine with me. 15 seconds to go and we will hit our next sprint. All right, get ready, get excited. Sprint number three, let's do it. Pick up those legs, keep pushing with those arms. Challenge yourself through the whole 30 seconds. All right, only you can keep yourself accountable. Keep pushing yourself. In five, four, three, two, and one. All right, slow it down. We have eight total sprints today, done with three. Five more to go. On this recovery time, take time to breathe. Nice deep breaths. Let's try to control that breathing in between our sprints. Ready, five more seconds. Sprint number four. In three, two, and one. Let's go, keep moving that body, fight for it. Every single sprint, I want you guys on it. All the way through, in five, four, three, two, and one. Relax. 
Nice deep breaths, we're halfway there. You guys are doing amazing. If you're starting to feel tired, that's okay, that's kind of the point, right? So let's stick with it. Finish out with these last four sprints. Make the most of our time. All right, ready. Sprint number five. In three, two, and one. Pick it up. Moving as fast as we can. Right, let's get that calorie burn up. Burn as many calories while we're here. And really work those muscles. Stay on it. In three, two, and one. Woo! All right, great work, you guys. Jog it out, nice and slow. Keep breathing. 10 more seconds. Sprint number six, coming in hot. Are you ready? Ready or not, let's do it. All right, let's go. Pick up that pace. This is where we really start to have to dig deep, right? We're starting to get tired. We are really working those muscles and our heart. Stay on it, keep pushing. We're almost there, right? This is the last little part of our workout. Make every minute count. In three, two, and one. Woo! Relax. Great work, you guys. Only two more sprints to go. Let's make them extra good. All right. Dig deep, find that energy deep within you. We're going to use every last drop. Ready, sprint number seven. In three, two, and one. Let's go. Push it. If you and I were sprinting on the street, would you let me beat you? I don't think so. Keep up. Let's pick up that pace. All out, as fast as you can. I know you can push your body harder. In three, two, and one. Whew, that was a good one. <laughs> All right, you guys, soak in this last rest. We only have one more to go. You're doing a beautiful job. Let's make this last one the best one of the day. 15 more seconds to go. We're going to hit our last sprint. All right, one more sprint between you and the end of this workout. Ready, in three, two, and one. Let's go. Come on, as fast as you can. Push that body. The faster, the better. 10 more seconds. All the way through. Come on, last little push. In three, two, and one. All right. Great work, you guys. Let's bring that resistance down if you have it up high. All the way down to one, nice and easy. We're gonna take a little cool down here. You guys got in some great work today. So let's make sure that you take what time you have to cool down that body. So important, especially after killing it with those sprint intervals. All right, so nice and slow. As slow as you need. Nice, deep breaths. Let's try to recover that oxygen that we depleted our body of during those sprints. Whew. Great work, you guys. All right, so this workout, it's such an awesome one, and I hope you guys continue to use this as you get more fit and more advanced. All you have to do is add more resistance 
or add more speed to make it more challenging. So a workout like this is something that I like to repeat in my routine over and over again. You will continue to see results if you continue to challenge yourself. All right, great job today, you guys. If you have more time, keep cooling down. Otherwise, thank you so much for joining me today. I had tons of fun working out with you on our ellipticals, and I will see you guys next time.